Hey everybody, Aaron Cowan, Sage Dynamics. This week's questions answered video, what do I think of outside the waistband holsters? Outside the waistband, obviously any holster that's worn on the belt, outside of the pant line, uh, generally at the waist. You don't really see them uh, at the hip, I should say. You don't really see them anywhere else. The question specifically is in regards to uh, non-retention holsters, such as uh, this right here. So it's an outside the waistband holster. It offers zero retention whatsoever besides the kydex retention on the firearm to keep the firearm roughly in place. Um, I see these sometimes in classes. Uh, and my biggest problem with them, if I were to have a problem with them, is the fact that uh, if the student is uh, normally carries in a concealed manner or always carries in a concealed manner, I don't want them taking a class in a holster like this because that's not the way that they're going to manipulate their firearm um, outside of the training environment. You should train like you carry. And we get tone deaf to that concept in some ways um, where you see people running holsters like this. Maybe they've got it on like some kind of molly belt with like all these different mag pouches and stuff like that. And it's cool because it's easy to throw on, go to the range, not really thinking about it, but it doesn't really fit the purpose. So my feelings on outside the waistband holsters, if you're going to conceal carry this way, so you're going to put this on and cover it up with a shirt or a, a recover garment, then that's great. But I wouldn't recommend using one of these in regards to practice or training if that's not the way that you carry. Obviously, a pretty easy answer, right? Uh, there's a lot of great outside the waistband holsters out there. If you do open carry, I would highly encourage you to do two things. One, get a retention holster. So level two, maybe even level three, depending on gun and, and what you like. And the second thing, of course, is going to be get some sort of weapon retention training. Uh, especially if you do make the mistake, and I'm going to call it a mistake, of carrying in a zero retention holster. Uh, you're losing a level of security there. and. Weapon retention is one of those things, even people who are trained in weapon retention have had their guns taken from them. Um, law enforcement is uh, one of the situations where people um, encounter uh, attempted weapon grabs. Um, weapon retention training, there's, there's guys out there that offer the classes, I would highly encourage you to take them. My personal advice is I wouldn't open carry in any holster that offered zero levels of active retention. So that's pretty much it. That's my feelings on outside the waistband carry. Uh, not too controversial. If you have any other questions specific to this topic or any other topic, you can drop them in the comment section below. I'm Aaron Count with Sage Dynamics. Train accordingly.